One Danville woman made a name for herself simply by helping others. Now, she died within days of her cancer diagnosis one year ago. But tonight, 10 News reporter McKinley Struther explains how her legacy is being remembered by the community and police with the goal of curbing crime and building bonds. Putting it into crime is a responsibility of everyone, not just police, but the community as well. Many communities across the country have worked hard to foster relationships between themselves and the police department. The same happening right here in Danville. Today, a group of people gathered in one neighborhood for one woman who encouraged everyone to do this type of work and so much more. I guess she saw something in the community that she liked. Perhaps she did. She never gave up and never left. That can make a difference. Step by step, the community honored Norma Brower, a woman who dedicated her life to serving the Danville community. These are things that we do every single month, community walks in different neighborhoods. Today, Danville PD and community organizations were in the Westmoreland neighborhood. This was one of the first neighborhoods when Chief Booth came here that he actually went through. There had been a crime situation here down the street, and we asked him to come. And McCoy, president of this neighborhood organization, believes that effort is paying off. Big time. Um, our crime numbers have dropped 50 percent since um, 2018. Brower passed away untimely one year ago after a very short battle with cancer. She served on the Fair Housing Board as VP of the local NAACP chapter and was among the first few calling on Danville PD to do more, to show up in their neighborhoods. But well, Danville PD answered that call. She was a type person. Uh, it would mean a lot to her. But she wasn't very, she wouldn't be very, very like, hey, they're doing this for me. A modest woman she was with a heart dedicated to helping her community. Community means everyone. And it's important that everyone realizes that they, they have a stake in what's here. McKinley Struther, 10 News, working for you.